A big win this week for students who are homeschooled. The group that oversees high school athletics in Indiana says sports teams at public schools must be inclusive and allow homeschooled kids to compete. News 10's Brent Fraser has reaction now from Park County. The IHSAA is leveling the playing field. Charlie Martin, athletic director and boys basketball coach at Riverton Park High School, calls the change a major victory for students who are homeschooled. You know, if someone lives in a corporation and I think that it's a, you know, fair thing for kids in, that live in that corporation to be able to, you know, participate in extracurricular activities in their corporation. I don't necessarily disagree with it at all. But some parents and athletes might. It's not just an open call legislated by the Indiana High School Athletic Association. Students who learn at home and want to join a high school team must adhere to strict guidelines to be eligible to play, including passing a physical and being at practice as required. Students must also have been homeschooled the previous three consecutive years. They must complete all statewide exams and grades have to be submitted to prove the student's passing. Homeschooled students must also take at least one class at the school they're playing for. Outside of that one hour a day, the homeschooled students will have little interaction with their public school peers. But Martin doesn't worry about outsiders being picked on or having trouble blending. If you have the right culture in place at your school and the right you know, policies and people working to watch out for those things, I think you know, that just goes with whatever the student may be. With photojournalist Cody Murphy, I'm Brent Frazier, News 10. The new IHSAA guidelines apply to high school age students only. They go into effect fall semester this year.